Animals that froze and came back to life. Alligators. Respiring alligators don't do anything as flashy as freezing their blood cells throughout the winter. So, you might be pondering how alligators have access to oxygen when the water bodies which make them survive freeze over. Well, alligators are able to withstand being locked in frozen ponds with a simple, intelligent trick. When ice bolts on their bodies, they stick their muzzle via the surface. Though they remain on the ice without moving, they can still maintain their breathing movement through their nose until the temperature warms up. Alligators were built tough through millions of years of evolution and frozen alligators enter a state of brumation which is similar to hibernation. Painted Turtle Hatchlings Discovered in freshwater habitats in Canada and the United States, the offsprings of painted turtles have an amazing adaptation that enables them live in harsh winters. Hatchlings are believed to be strong to icy conditions by steering clear freezing together. A lessened metabolic rate that drops their energetic needs to the lowest. These turtles can remain in a supercooled state in temperature as low as 28 degrees Fahrenheit for around 3 days. They have a unique ability to warm and fall out. They can also endure partial freezing, surviving even substantial ice formations within their tissues. Their response to cold weather varies depending on the environmental conditions surrounding their nest. Iguanas cold-blooded animals, iguana for example can freeze up when temperatures get below the Fahrenheit degrees of 40 or 50. This implies that if iguana were primarily high up in the trees, they are on their way down as Frank Serabino, a Twitter user captured in his backyard in Florida when temperatures lessened in January. Fortunately, they are not deceased. As disclosed by National Geographic, iguana blood has slowed down and they are in a lethargic state akin to a deep sleep. These iguanas are temporarily immobilized by the cold and will be running around again once the outside temperature rises. Arctic Ground Squirrel Arctic ground squirrels are the only mammal on this list and for good reason like the other contenders, these squirrels can also supercool their bodies below its freezing point down to minus 2.9 degrees Celsius. Every September Arctic ground squirrels in Alaska, Canada and Siberia retreat into burrows more than a meter beneath the tundra curl up in nests built from grass, lichen and caribou hair and begin to hibernate as their lungs and heart slow the rivers of blood flowing through their bodies. Their core body temperatures plummet dipping below the freezing point of water during hibernation. Electrical signals zipping along crisscrossing neural highways vanish in many areas of the brain. Five months later squirrels wake up and return to the surface famished, eager to mate and perfectly healthy. Hibernating mammals survive for so long at such low temperatures without any food or water by storing in their own fat. The arctic ground squirrel's brain in particular seems to be incredibly resilient when ground squirrels hibernate, their neurons shrink and many connections between neurons shrivel but their brains periodically compensate for this loss. Darkling Beetle In the depths of the Alaskan winter the UPS beetle endures temperatures as low as minus 104 degrees Fahrenheit. The Alaskan darkling beetle can withstand temperatures as low as minus 104 degrees Fahrenheit by keeping its watery cells from freezing solid. Unlike many other animals and organisms that use proteins as antifreeze agents, this smart beetle produces a sugar-based antifreeze called xylomannan. The substance doesn't actually prevent freezing but instead slows ice formation and ensures the freezing process doesn't get enough to damage the beetle cells. This strategy means the beetles remain unfrozen down to minus 7.5 degrees Celsius or 18.5 degrees Fahrenheit. 
wood frog. The wood frog adopts cold weather and makes sure it survives by freezing its body up to 70%, which includes the brain and eye lens, as stated by Earth Touch News Network. The wood frog's heart completely stops, just like its muscles and also its breathing. When spring wheels around, the hard body of the frog simply freezes out and gets back to the way it was. This cycle is reiterated on and on again each winter. How do the frogs do it? Wood frogs have germinating proteins, which drains most of the water out of the frog's cells. Coincidentally, the liver of the frog produces glucose, which occupies its cells and functions as a sugary syrup to save them from freezing solid. Water gets back into the cells of the frog at the moment their body warms up again.